morning, everybody. I am going to talk about the importance of decluttering your house when selling it. One reason that it's good a good idea to declutter your house whenever you're selling it is that it enhances the visual appeal. It appears more spacious and inviting whenever buyers come to look at it. It also highlights key features instead of people focusing on your things. People can look at, you know, do you have a beautiful French door? Well, if it's covered with boxes and things of that nature, then the buyers may overlook it because they're looking at your clutter instead of your house. It also creates a neutral canvas. It makes sure that, you know, buyers are more apt to be able to see their particular furniture and their things in your house, which, you know, they can visualize being in it a little bit better. Um, it's also easier to clean. A lot of times buyers, you know, may request to look at your house at the last minute. And if your house is already decluttered, it's a lot easier to clean. It also fosters a, you know, better first impression. If people come in and all they see are, you know, packed boxes or too much furniture, you know, it just, it, do, it just doesn't look as good as if, you know, you get all of that out. Um, it also, like I said before, it emphasizes storage space. So if people need a lot of, you know, space for storage, you know, they'll be able to see that instead of like, oh my gosh, they have all this, you know, these boxes and all of this stuff and they still don't have enough space. So that's another good reason to, you know, thin out all of your things. Um, it also aids in this, you know, the staging efforts. You know, if everything's just so packed in, then, you know, it's just hard to stage to make a good first impression. Um, it also reduces the perception of, you know, a lot of maintenance. You know, and, and an idea, is, a, a good idea too, is um, if you, while you're decluttering your house, you know, you could have like a yard sale, but you also could um, donate to, you know, some thrift shops. I know some people like to sell their goods online. There's so many different ways to do it. I know in the past, my preferred, you know, way to do things is just the things that I no longer need, then I will just donate them to the thrift shop because, you know, people that actually need those items can get them. And oftentimes, you know, you, there are tax benefits to donating to thrift shops. You would just need to talk to your tax advisor about that. But those are just, um, you know, just a brief overview of the reasons why you should decl declutter your house whenever you're getting ready to sell it. And some ideas on what to do with your items if, um, you know, you, you need to get rid of them. But I'm going to go into more in depth of um, this topic on my website, which is auburnopalikaalrealestate.com if you'd like to learn more about it and to dive into it in more depth.